All right, welcome back. I hope you enjoyed the introductory lesson from the godfather of Carver, Leo LeBay. Uh, there's no doubt that Leo knows his stuff when it comes to assessments. Uh, as you can see, I've ditched my suit in favor of a more casual look. Uh, the reason being, it's time to roll up our collective sleeves and get down to the nuts and bolts of learning the Carver methodology. In this lesson, Leo will give you the history of Carver and then define the value structure of each of the Carver letter criteria. Uh, I know you're anxious to get started, so once again, here's Leo. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and start uh, the Carver module and I'll probably go halfway through it and then we'll go ahead and take a break. Uh, but this, we jump into this very early on in the course because throughout the course, this is what we're gonna be talking about. Okay, module provide the skills necessary uh, to conduct a vulnerability assessment using the Carver methodology. And what does a vulnerability assessment do? It identifies high risk assets, characterizes and prioritizes those assets, assesses vulnerability and consequences. Carver does this for you, all right? Only thing Carver won't do, and this comes from your skill set that you possess, is recommend risk reduction and countermeasures. So Carver will tell you what needs to be protected. It's up to you to come up with uh, the countermeasures and the risk reduction methodologies that you're going to use. So Carver does the first three, you do the last one. 